Hi, everyone. This is Pam Coey. I'm keeping my voice down just a little bit because we have two new puppies and they're sleeping. And we don't want to wake up sleeping puppies. They're in my studio right now. I'm here to let you know this is a continuation of my uh, lexicon series of eight paintings. And uh, I'm thankful to Art Spirit Gallery in Coeur d'Alene, Idaho. They've sold all eight paintings. So yay. But uh, I'm still uh, processing these videos for you. And I want to let you know that in this part seven, I will be working on two paintings in the series that all started with slop words. And just to, to let you know what a slop word is, it's uh, any leftover paint, any color, doesn't matter. It's just thrown onto a Baltic birch panel. And I had, uh, you'll see me using a slop word in this video. So if you don't know what a slop word is, you'll see that I'm putting leftover paint uh, on a 12 by 12 inch Baltic birch panel. So the whole series is done on these panels, which I love. And just a shout out to rexart.com. These, uh, these panels are great because uh, when Rexart sends you the panel, you can also get a frame that fits it. And they have all kinds of combinations where you can buy um, the frame with the panel. You can buy the panel by itself. Um, you can buy the frame by itself. So they're a very custom uh, family-owned U.S. company, which I love. And so I highly recommend them to you. And uh, I'll have a link below so you can find them. It's just rexart.com. And I'm going to be doing a special this month for a free giveaway of Rex Art Frames. So you definitely want to be subscribed to my channel and hit that notification bell. And please like the video if you'd like a lot more giveaways, because I'm more than happy to do that. So in this video, what I'll be doing is um, working on two paintings in the series and moving them forward. Now, the reason why I think it's really, really important to work on two paintings at a time, or three, or four, or five, is it takes the pressure off of that one. Like, I used to work on one painting at a time, and if it wasn't really working well, I'd be like, well it's not working. So I guess I'll just wait until I can feel inspired again. In this case, I've got two paintings side by side. And what happens is they speak to one another. It's like a conversation. And so while I'm working on one, you know, I'm moving that forward. And then the one beside it is kind of like, well, are you going to work on me now? And yes, I will. Uh, and I might use some of the same ideas, the same colors, the same texture. And as I do that, they inform one another. And that's the whole idea behind a series. That is how you create cohesion in your work. And what I'll be doing here is I'm showing you how I use tracing paper and how I place my shapes, like a shape. If you have a stencil and you cut out a shape or trace a shape, just keep in mind, it doesn't all have to be on your painting. You might have it going off the edge a little bit. That creates a bit of excitement. Here we go. This is Lexicon Series Part 7. And this paper has some interesting texture, and that's why I want to try it, because it'll be interesting when I sand it back.
that shape. It's any better than this shape. Yeah, maybe. Okay, I'm not sure if you're gonna like this or not. I try it. that one good for ready for sanding anyway and then this one too so if we look at these guys together um considering how far apart they were before I do you think that they're speaking to one another a lot better now and this is still pretty bright um Well, when I, after I sand it and glaze it, I think I'll set that one back and um, or maybe it would. Okay, so I think I'm going to stop for now, and that was um, two and a half hours, and I think I made a lot of progress, so that's good. Um, tomorrow is our episode 11. I'm going to sand these back like this, and so I wanted to get these to the point where I could sand them back. I think that they're ready to be sanded and um, they're going to look like a mess, but um, that's to be expected when you sand back. Okay, everyone. Thank you. See you later.